Hello there, I'm Natasha, and in today's video, I'll be showing you how to easily get into the Slytherin common room in just under 5 minutes. If you want to get into the other common rooms, please check out my YouTube page, as I'll be releasing videos on how to glitch into all of the houses. First up, you want to open up your main menu, you want to go along to the map, and you want to locate Irondale on your map. Once heading there, you'll want to head over to this house that I'm flying to right now, and you'll want to walk over to the cloth. Once you're over there, you'll realize that your character will glitch a little bit. Just walk around a little bit more, and your character will walk through the floor. If you do end up glitching a little bit, like my character does, just make sure that you walk up to the stone platform. Once here, you'll be able to walk around and be able to fly. Once you're on your broom, you'll want to open up your map and place a waypoint towards Hogwarts. That way, you'll know that you're headed the right direction. This may take a little while, depending on what broomstick upgrades you have, so we're going to skip this bit. Once you're here, you'll want to make sure that you are underneath this building that I'm located at. It's right outside the flying class, if you're used to it, outside the main courtyard. And if you turn around opposite the greenhouses, you should be able to see the Slytherin common room windows. What you want to do is you want to fly up to them and you'll see this little rock with a gap. You want to fly straight through that but make sure you're a bit low otherwise it might hop you out of the map again. Turn around and you'll see three windows. They don't look like anything much right now but what you want to do is you will want to step on this stone and then just dismount your broom. Once you dismount, you are literally in the Slytherin common room and you are free to walk around and interact with anything you want. I hope you enjoy looking around and exploring the Slytherin common room just as much as I did, even if you're not a Slytherin student. And if you're interested in glitching into more of the houses, please make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and to check out more of my videos for Hogwarts Legacy updates. Thanks for watching!